So we are currently in Beaverton, Oregon. Um, I found a mobile vet for goats. I swear to goodness that if you want to be very, very rich, become a goat vet because there are none. They're like non-existent. I'm not even kidding you. It is crazy trying to find someone who will work on a goat <laughs> or knows anything about it. Um, anyway, so Little Leaf I mean, she looks pretty normal, but I can just tell that she's not 100%. And um, my vet said that if she were to start breathing with her mouth open, then I need to get her to emergency right away. But I'm on the road. I don't know where that could be, and I don't want to risk that. So I'm thinking more preventative. Um, try to nip it in the butt before it gets serious. Um, she's drank a little bit of water today with Pedialyte. That's my trick. She loves the blue-colored Pedialyte. <laughs> Um, and she's obviously eating, so I don't know. I just at night it gets really bad, and I don't like seeing her like that. And it, it looks like she's really struggling and it's scary. So, and this guy agreed that she does have quite a bit of a fever. So, yeah, we're gonna take care of her first. Adventure on hold, no big deal. Little Leaf's first camping trip. Here's checking out the neighbors, being nosy. <laughs> Was this people's over there? <laughs> huh, little leaf? Right now she's like in the tabletop. I think she feels a little more protected. We got camp all set up here. A little potty bin inside there. You can't see it. <laughs> Her dinner spot. I've got my old berry can out. I'm trying to figure out what I want for dinner. And uh, some new Vaunt lanterns. Gonna try those out. The company Vaunt sponsored me a couple of those to try and give away to some of my followers so we'll see how those work later tonight when it gets darker pretty exciting other than that just chilling quarantine had me crazy i needed to get away i needed this very much even if it is in a structured camp area i don't care <laughs> it works we needed to practice somewhere hold it a leaf we needed to practice somewhere huh What's her think? See, that's my cup. Get out of there. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing in my bear can? You defeated it, but the but the bears can't. It's not goat proof. Give me this. You don't want no tuna fish. You don't want no tuna fish. I probably want some olives. Oh, yep, I want some olives. <laughs> You taking those? Excuse me. You're gonna squish all my olives. Good. <laughs> Leave no trace, little leaf. <laughs> you wanna go for a walk? You wanna go for a walk? You wanna go see the river? You wanna eat peanuts? <laughs> hey goat. Whoa. <laughs> Her still kind of had the cold. We've got some Pedialyte and children's aspirin. I've got cups of water everywhere, hoping she'll drink more than she has. <clears throat> hey, want to go for a walk? With Leaf. Want to go for a walk? E -e -e -e. It's pretty nice. A waterfall coming down that rock. That's beautiful. Nice swim hole right here. I tell you what. Might be cracking tomorrow. What's your think, little leaf? What do you think? So now go for more of a walk. You don't eat that good girl. Alright, we're gonna test our first bridge. Are you ready? You ready? Okay, come on. Come on. Her can do it. I know her can. Oh, we got lanes on the bridge.
take it in. Uh, some spooky gators rolling around, huh? Okay, come on. Come on. Let it leave. Hey, hey. Come on. Come on. Let's try the bridge. Come on. Good girl. Oh, you feel it move? <laughs> Those ears. <laughs> oh, come on. We're doing a good job. It's okay. Just checking it out. Her's a brave goat. Her's a brave goat. Look at her. No problem. You bouncing? <laughs> Beautiful, huh? Check out that side. That's a big girl. That was way easier than I thought it was going to be with you. Oh, there's a swim hole up here. She's figured it out, but now she wants to run. <laughs> What's her doing? Her want to run through the woods? <laughs> I can't run in flip flops, girl. I got the wrong hiking shoes on. <laughs> Go on. You know how to do this? <laughs> Pulling me across. Hey, slow down, Turbo. Where did her sink? <laughs> her did sink in this tent. Yeah? Pretty cool, huh? All these things on top of it. Yeah. <laughs> Batteries and phones and music and lights. And you got her sleeping bag over here. I moved your pillow though. Yeah. Eat, eat. Oh, there you. My hair looks so worried. My hair looks so worried. Those babies can't get you. No, the babies can't get you. We're okay. This is our first time in the tent. So, we'll see how she adjusts. Every time we do something new, it takes a, it takes a little bit. So I'm in my tent with Little Leaf. <laughs> my big Angus, my new tent. Even got her potty bin in here. Some water, her little bed with her sleeping bag here and some backup since she's been sick. But um, this company, Vaunt, had sent me these lanterns who apparently were telling me that somebody took their design and made a knockoff. So they gifted me four of these and wanted me to try them and give a review. And it was months ago, but of course with COVID and everything, I hadn't tried them. And so I just pulled them out and I'm so bummed I didn't figure these out sooner because this is so cool. So the bottom screws on with some batteries and then you just slide it down. And this thing is a light. Like that gives out a ton of light. It's pretty cool. Pretty stoked about it. So um, I feel like I'm glamping because I have Bluetooth and a lantern right now. And a goat. She can't figure out how to get out of the tent though. What do you think, little leaf? What you think, little leaf? You can go potty. You're just gonna stand in it. What do you think of the light? What do you think of this light with the leaf? It's pretty bright, huh? She looks so tiny in here. This tent is huge. Got my um, enlightened equipment bag with me. Some mappage to figure out where I want to journey to next. What's her doing? Trying to escape? 
<laughs> you cannot stop it. <laughs> it's still daylight, but it's like six something. She hasn't been feeling good, so she was ready to. She's pretty warm. I gave her some aspirin and applesauce. But her wanted to get in her sleeping bag and take a rest. So she's all snuggled in. <laughs> in her own pillow and everything. Her all cozy. Her all cozy goats. In her sleeping bag. <laughs> this is a wild rider bag, by the way. These things are so awesome. She loves it. Normally made for dogs, but close enough. Even cooler for goats. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the girl that makes them, her name is Rachel. And uh, she's a really good seamstress. She knows what she's doing. She makes them like actual sleeping bags instead of some cheap little thin things. They actually are insulated and washable, which makes sense for any kind of animal. I think down would be silly for a dog bed. <laughs> Just because... They get so wet and stuff running through the trees and grass. Yeah, look at that cute little nugget. It's a little ball of happy. Well, maybe not today. But we're getting better. We're taking it easy. Sweet baby.